Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Mpumelelo Magagula. Thank you so much for stopping by. Oh my god, I have missed you. I've missed recording, but it's been a hectic week. I am getting better. Life is laughing, but work has to continue. So guys, hi bo, I'm so shocked. Not scandal, ETV being scandalous. Hi bo, the nerve of the casting director. So, film panel reported that Silo Sebutane will be playing um, Prosecutor Sohualo, a corrupt prosecutor who will release uh, more from jail in the soapy, right? So, if you watch Scandal just like me, you'd know that Amo is already out and Amo was in jail because um, he was abusing Uthengiwe and also in the process included Udintle, you know? So, it was the storyline of GPV and how um, in South Africa turns a blind blind eye to Egypt. PV, right fine oh, amo is out oh, thank you. is outraged to go to why amo is out now we found out to the person okay but oh, amo is this protect prosecutor so well played by an alleged abuser silo like make it make sense how twisted can it be oh my god so people are not happy i am also not happy because as you remember um, I think I was still, not I think, I was still an intern um, at, at one of um, the publications in South Africa, right? And we attended a court case in 2018 where Shoki Mula, who's also on Scandal Now, detailed how she was abused by this ex-husband usilo right i think we went there and then they were both there but i remember her detailing the abuse and then they also said that the child was going to testify but the child was not going to be inside the court case because she was afraid of her father and obviously she was young but then scandal a few weeks ago Bastelo would know Shoki Mola is joining Scandal. She's gonna be playing this pasta Uzoba Mamaga Vuvu. Chigi Chigi, a few weeks later, you hire her alleged abuser. So you want the victim and the alleged abuser to share colleagues, to share a working space. How do you do that? Oh my god. So Beba Yekawiaban to that you could hire to play the prosecutor. And I told Film Pella that Shoki is not shooting at the moment. That just that does not justify anything. Honestly, it doesn't. Because why would you want Silo and Shoki to be colleagues? What's gonna happen the day they are supposed to shoot on the same day or around the same time or after each other? You know? Guys, please, man. Like you could have done better. You could have done better. I am so mad at this scandal. Oh my god, I love Scandal, but wow, the casting director and everybody else who took the decision to hire this man. I know that yeah, people change, we have to give people a chance, but to hire Omunta up is Muntu Asens and I ain't the only one really wow. We are definitely not seeing he's supposed to be out of a job, he's not supposed to be acting and stuff. He is a good actor, he deserves roles, but not for you to hire him a few okay to announce that he's joining Scandal a few weeks after announcing that Shoki um is with Scandal. So this means that Shoki was hired first and then he was hired after. Why would you do that though? Like, I am also trying to find out to what are you teaching us about GPV because this storyline is about GPV and this man is an alleged abuser. Can't you, like, just use a mind for like two seconds? But anyway, we live in South Africa. Nothing surprises us anymore because Yonkin Zepo Iawasha people do as they please. And you know what? Maybe Bazoto they gave him a chance because he's a good actor. Wara wara. I just hope that Shoki will be fine and Shoki has healed. And maybe she won't have a problem working with her ex husband who allegedly abused her okay i saw her face in court i heard her speaking in court i was there myself in 2018 wow well let's move on to lighter and better news congratulations to candace kadesh who was on metro fm you remember that um she was giving us the tea with uncle tap which means now they have both left yfm and film Pella announced that 
Candice will be joining Metro FM and will be co-hosting the breakfast show with um with DJ Sebi. So DJ Sebi will be taking over the Metro FM breakfast, and this also means that Ukuzo Teledi will be moving. Islot Sake Esisha will be the bridge from nine to midday, and she will be hosting that one with Usomizi. And this also means that Somizi is back on radio and and he is going to be taking over two slots so it is reported that he is going to be co-hosting the weekend breakfast and also co-hosting with Okuto Teleri I love Somizi but can we please have new talents can we please give other people a chance Somizi left and then now he's back it's not like also means he would DJ Fresh, you know, the radio boss and stuff. I know that he's famous. He comes with the numbers. But can we give other people a chance? As much as we are also complaining, good to know, Mam Nankola Khrotbom is nice. She's a veteran. But now it's time for her to mentor other people and then give other people a chance. I think we can do the same with Somizi. No hate, whatever. But banding abanta bafundile, banding abantu have a talent. Let's consider opening up the industry. Nonetheless, congratulations. Congratulations to him. He comes with the numbers. We all love him. He is entertaining. But yeah, we really need new voices, honestly. But yeah, that is that. Congratulations to Candace. Congratulations to DJ Sebi. Congratulations to Kuto and everybody else who got new jobs, you know, in this radio season. We will be listening. We will be watching all of you. So my name is Mpomenelo Makagula. I will see you guys when I have another video. Bye.